Teenage Bonnie and Clyde on the run with two of their friends. These suspected car thieves managed to get away from police during a high-speed chase. And now the reasons to find them may be more urgent than ever. ABC's Lindsay Davis is on the story. Good morning. Good morning, Dan. Brianna, she's been missing since Monday with her boyfriend and two other male teens. Brianna Gomez is 15. She is wanted by police and she has diabetes. So each day that she remains on the run is all the more critical. This morning, police in at least two states are on the hunt for 15-year-old Brianna Gomez and her 16-year-old boyfriend, Spencer Linville. Gomez's grandfather is making a plea for her safe return. I don't want to lose my granddaughter. Police say the couple's alleged Bonnie and Clyde-style crime spree began on Tuesday near their home in Eau Claire, Wisconsin, where investigators say, along with two other teens, Gomez and Linville stole a car and then fled. They were next spotted outside of Denver, Colorado on Thursday, where officials say the young lovers led sheriff's deputies on a more than 30-mile high-speed chase through Morgan and Logan counties before allegedly ditching that stolen car and stealing a new one. Wisconsin police say while the teens could be headed anywhere, one possible destination is Southern California. Her boyfriend's father has a fishing boat out in Riverside, California. Police say the stakes in this manhunt are higher than just grand theft auto. While searching the car abandoned by the teens, investigators discovered Gomez, a diabetic, also left behind the insulin she needs to survive. There's going to be consequences for what you have done, but we don't care about that. We love you no matter what happens. We just want our granddaughter safe. Gomez was recently released from six months in juvenile detention for various run-ins with police. Her grandfather says they know she'll have to pay the price for her most recent actions, but they just want her back because the teen is prone to seizures. She needs insulin. He says that without it, she could die. So this is a dangerous situation on many levels. Very dangerous. And she initially did bring the insulin with her. It's just that she left it behind in one of the getaway cars. It's painful to see how upset her grandfather right, is. Right, of course, yes. All right, Lindsay, thank, thank you. you.